Hey everyone, welcome back. I've got some exciting news for Murph AI users. If you're not familiar with Murph AI, it's currently one of the best text-to-speech voiceover tools out there. Now, they've just announced a direct integration with Canva. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use your Murph account inside Canva to create voiceovers for your presentations. Here's how it looks. To access this feature, click on Apps, scroll down, and under AI-powered apps, click on See All. You'll find Murph AI listed there. You can add Murph directly to an existing design or in a new design. To install Murph to your account, follow the steps I've already shown. Once installed, open your Canva account and then access the presentation you'd like to create a voiceover for. Let's say this is our presentation and we want to start adding a voiceover with Murph. Take a look at this. Here at the left side, it now click on apps and you fill find Murph AI. When I click on it, you have to connect it with your account and it will gives me the option to create voiceovers directly inside of Canva. That's pretty exciting, right? You can choose here from all the available languages inside Murph AI, and you can pick the voices that you would like to use. Let's say these are the three voices, and this demo, I'm not gonna show you all the voice, not gonna listen to all the voices because the purpose is to create a presentation with a voiceover from Murph AI, but I, for example, really like those two voices, so simply choose a voice from the options available. Let's say we're going to work with this one. It sounds great. Now, all you need to do is paste your text into this field. You can go to your presentation, copy the text, and then paste it here. In this example, I'm going to use the text from this presentation. The only adjustments you may want to make are to the speed and pitch of your voiceover. Let's keep them at default settings and generate the voiceover. Artificial intelligence and its impact on the future. That sounds good, doesn't it? If you feel like you'd prefer a slower pitch, you can make that adjustment right here. Perhaps you also want the pitch to be a bit lower. In that case, you can simply regenerate the voiceover with your desired settings. If you're satisfied with the result, you can click on Add to Presentation. Now, go to the slide where you want to incorporate this voiceover. In this example, I'll go to the first slide and click on Add Design to Design. As you can see, the voice has been added to the first slide. If the slide is too long, you can click on it and trim the time accordingly. Now for the second slide, you can do the same. Copy this, paste it here. One additional feature I haven't shown you yet is that with this voice, you can also choose different styles. For instance, this is the promo style. You have various style options, such as conversational, calm, sad, newscast, angry, terrified, promo, or inspirational. In this case, let's try the conversational dial first and see how it sounds. Let's reset the speed to zero because it often sounds best and then generate a voiceover. It is important to understand the utilities of artificial intelligence. Great. Now, for the second slide, click on add to design again, and voila, you now have two voices added to the slides. That's what I wanted to share with you, how easy it is to seamlessly integrate your Murph AI account within Canva. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Additionally, if you'd like to see more content, consider subscribing to my channel. Hit that subscription button and the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. Thanks again for watching, and I hope to see you in my next video.